Even though I've been playing this game for what feels like, I don't know, centuries now. Hey, I think we've checked these, haven't we? Ah, uh, we haven't. Perfect. I still get excited when I get a chance to play this game. Like, I just... I don't even know, man. I just... I adore the crap out of this game. It's janky. It's buggy. Development is slower than pretty much anything out there. And yet, it is just so much fun to play. So, here we are. Another day, another episode of Romero Mod, and we have... Uh, I think have gone long enough that I can start shooting things and I don't have to worry about whatever weird rules YouTube has in place this week. I keep mentioning that more as a joke than anything else, because honestly, I don't really care. I've debated for a long time just plain removing ads, like, who cares? I'll, I'll do it eventually. And that's not really the reason I do this. I mean, I don't know, whatever. If you really want to support people, support them directly through Patreon or other means. Don't... I don't know, I mean... Everyone uses an ad blocker, so ads on uh, YouTube videos, I mean, I guess if you're getting millions and millions of views are amazing, but I'm not, so I don't know. Do whatever you want to do. Like I said, you really want to support people? Do it on Patreon or something. Let's go into this building where we have already activated our quest. And there will most assuredly be zombies inside because... This is a clear quest. I don't even remember when we got this one. It's been a sneeze. And that's okay. We're just going to kind of rip through and... Oh, hi. I thought there was something back there. I was thinking there was uh, going to be something around the corner here, but there's, <laughs> there's nothing around the corner because it's not really a corner per se. Whatever. It's all good. Uh, sure, we'll go ahead and check that guy right quick. Oh, you know what? We'll take 40 clay. We can use that. That'll save us some trouble later on. I don't know if there's anything really to check over here. It doesn't look like it. We'll just keep on going. Uh, we should check in here, though. Bathrooms are, you know, often one of the... My bad. Wrong door. My bad. Wrong door. My bad. Wrong door. There we go. That's the right door. I knew I'd get to it eventually. Uh, I don't know if we really need a bunch of murky water. I'm just going to go ahead and leave that for now. I think we have enough empties and we have a water source on the map multiple water sources on the map. I was thinking like a, a big old lake to the north. Well, I don't know. There's a little one there and a little one there and there's snow. So whatever. We are not lacking for water, at least water options. So not super concerned about it for right now. Come on, something. Never mind. I mean, it wasn't bad. I was just hoping for something we could use. That's all. I did bring a repair kit with us right there, that guy. Hi, how you doing? Busy! Busy! Rude. Because I thought we probably would like to repair the wrench. Crap. I'm not liking that one. I, I feel pretty definitively that I shot the arrow right through him. Whatever. I thought we should use the repair kit on the wrench. It's just looking a little wonky. I mean, we don't need to do it right now, but... My hunch is that it's going to be uh, wrecked before too long, and... Oh, goodness. All right, if I'm going to do that... I mean, I just kind of reflexively took that because I was half expecting it to be proper, you know, good water, and it wasn't. So let's go grab that one. Let's, you know, be consistent and all. Eh. And scrap those guys. We don't need to carry them right now. And then I suppose we can go ahead and grab this right quick. Yep, that's the tool I wanted to use. Exactly that one. Okay. I say there's definitely stuff breaking, whether it's ceiling or floor. I'm not sure which. That was just a pathetic shot right there. Let's just go ahead and admit that. I wasn't even aiming at that guy. I mean, I'm not going to complain about, you know... One shot, one kill, but that was a very, very sad first shot there. That was just awful. I should be ashamed of myself. No? Ah, uh, okay. Let's go this way then. Um, I don't know what I want. Do I want bow? Do I want this? I mean, this seems to make more sense in close quarters, right? You're not dead yet? How are you not dead yet? Because I keep missing your face because we're so close. So close, I cannot get your face. Okay. 
There we go. All nice and done. How you doing? Kabonk. How you doing? Kabonk. All right. Cannot interact with that vending machine. That's kind of a shame. I was thinking maybe we could buy something from it. I'm not really sure what that would be. Coffee. Coffee beans. Okay. I'm trying to be better about using coffee in this game. I'm decidedly anti-coffee half the time, so, you know, I can mix and match and do different things sometimes. Uh, there's something behind here, isn't there? Pile of books hidden there. What is this? Fahrenheit 451? Hello? Oh, that was your hand. Ugh, that must have hurt. Oh, stay down, my man. Stay down. Look at that little computer. Isn't that a delight? More books. Hmm. Alpha 20 books are just garbage. I mean, honestly, I really look forward to the uh, mailboxes and all that stuff more than bookcases at this point. I mean, maybe outside of a, a proper bookstore where you've got enough of them that you got a decent chance, enough bookcases that is, that you've got a decent chance of spawning something useful, but if you don't have that, well, it's just going to be massive disappointment. I thought I'd take the shot. Wasn't a good one, but I tried. Let's get upstairs. I should mention, just for the giggles, today I'm running the game... Oh, hi. Oh, I was going to say we need to stop and be... Um, Serious for a moment here, but everyone keeps losing their head. Look at that, man. That right there that deserves a round of applause. That was three consecutive headshots. Boom, boom, and boom. That was good stuff right there. I really enjoyed that. I don't even know what I was saying anymore. I totally got sidetracked because that was that was awesome. That's what that was. I was going to say that I am actually running the game in Vulcan today, just, I don't know, for the giggles. When I say Vulcan, I don't mean the language. I'm not playing this in, you know, like, Klingon or something. I mean, I'm using Vulcan as the renderer. I've been meaning to try it out, so thought, let's try it out. Go ahead and take that mod. I don't think we'll ever use it, though. Uh, let's take that, that, scrap, and scrap, and we'll leave the rest. Trying to be remotely consistent about are we or are we not. Uh, yeah, this works. Taking books and, you know, if we already have them, there's no need. I know. Free experience. Oh, this is the guy that I took a shot at on the on the street, I think. Four in a row. Excellent. All I needed was... That's going to hurt. Whew. That one missed shot on that, that guy, no less. And then, boom, we are just in the head shot central <laughs> look at that crap and look at all that stuttering this is no oh, it's ruined now i got greedy i should have been smart and just played the angles i didn't dude this bow is just wrecking right now nope oh man i just whipped you ducked you ducked, madam. Oh, I don't even know. I guess that went through your shoulder or something. Hi. Keep looking. I do think we have a wandering horde is what's going on here. I mean, just judging by the massive amount of zombies around. I don't know if we're going to be able to collect all the arrows here. I was actually shooting at her. Not you. You got your face in the way. Your shoulder or something. All right. Oh, that was just a terrible shot. I don't even know why I'm using arrows at this point. There's no real need. Just trying to... Hey, that just buzzed his ear. Um. Oh, all right. Here, fine. We'll do that with you, and then we'll bash the crap out of this guy. And I want to see if we have any arrows lying around that we can pick up, because we don't have tons of them. There we go. That worked out pretty well. That was a good chunk of experience, and this guy, if I can find his face, or the back of it, 
Should be a level. Yeah, that worked out nicely. Madam, here, just for the giggles. I mean, at this point, I've already been bashing so many of them. What's two more? Oh, that guy was a shoulder death. That's interesting. Let's go grab the mini bike and we are going to get out of here. First order of business is to turn around and go this way because these guys should have respawned. By these guys, I of course mean the mail box and all these other uh, boxes. You didn't respawn. You're not part of the POI. You're part of the street. I stand corrected. Okay. I mean, technically, I'm sitting, so I'm on a bike, so I sit corrected. I mean, I don't know. Where do we want to go at this point? We've got, you know, world is our oyster type of thing. These ones we haven't hit, so let's hit these guys, because there are still a couple of arrow books we need. Bow books. And those are not them. Here, we'll go ahead and snag these, though. There's definitely still some stuff that we can do out here. I mean, aside from, you know, just running quests and all that jazz. I think just for the giggles, let's go check out the urgent care. And this is kind of a fun one. How you doing, buddy? Here, let's go ahead and get our arrows reloaded or re-knocked. Knocked? Re-knocked? Whatever. Mm, scrap and take. One of these days, I'll actually invest some skill into medical so we can use the aloe cream we keep finding everywhere. I mean, right now, there's no use for it. It obviously has a use, just we can't use it. Which kind of begs the question of what's the point? I don't know. Oh, hi. I was actually going to get a different thing out, but this one works. Right, let's do this. Medicine cabinet. Oh, that's all good stuff there, except for the last one. Didn't mean to grab that one. Tell you what, you hold that. It'll be fine. Sounds like there might be more zombies from the outside coming in. Aside from any zombies that are obviously inside trying to get to us. So, you know, there's that. How you doing? Oh, I, for a second, I just wasn't sure what I was seeing. I just knew I needed to back up. Way ambulance! Ran past one of these in the early stages of this playthrough. My bad. I think we were even infected, so it was like double whammy of like, dude, you literally just ran past an ambulance. Yeah, I know. Didn't mean to. I just guess I was focused on other things. Let's go ahead and just power attack. I'm tired of you. I mean, I don't even really want to check these guys, but I guess since we're grabbing water, it's not going to be that big a deal to grab a little more, right? So this is going to get us downstairs. I don't remember if this is a downstairs, upstairs place. I think we need to go downstairs to go upstairs or something, or maybe we can go upstairs before we go downstairs. I don't honestly remember this one. I just know that I enjoy any place that gives me healing stuff. Uh, sure. We'll take the eye candy. We'll take the jailbreakers. Those save us trouble later on. You know what? Just for the giggles, we're going to buy that now. And since we're holding the not a mace, but a steel club, we'll just get some extra bashing damage for the for the moment. That sounds like a good idea to me. I'm okay with that. So we do still have some options to go downstairs. This is not the final loot up here, obviously. And we'll go ahead and bash this guy open. Great. We'll take all those things. Those are fine. Right, let's go downstairs now. And then this gets us back inside and we can just go in this way. I don't care. Is the... Oh, this is... Hmm. Not what I was expecting. Hey, look at that. We got our first proper firearm of the game. It's complete and utter crap. But it is a proper firearm. And I think it is our first one. I, I don't think I'm... I'm not forgetting one, am I? I mean, that's very possible. 
I don't think I am, though. Uh, I don't care about hops, seeds. We're, we're just not going to do any sort of uh, farming. Farming is stupid in this game. It used to be good. Now it's just stupid. Yeah. All right. I'm going to go ahead and admit it. I'm not sure where or if <laughs> there even is any final loot at this point. Um, maybe there's not in this one. I don't know. Okay, let's go ahead and pop this guy down. I mean, there's still definitely some zombies about. All right, I just wanted to see. I think we were up here, were we not? That was where we exited the upstairs, was right here. Yeah, okay. Don't you mess with the frames, buddy. You're going to get one really harsh uh, bash to the face. Okay. I probably missed the final loot, so just do me a favor and tell me where it was. Good. Let's go check the other ambulance over here. Gotta be careful with those power attacks. Run out of stamina. Look at that. That was perfect. I mean, is it in here? I think that was just the hallway. But I just, I see zombies, so I gotta, I gotta kill them. There we go. Yeah, it's just the hallway. Oh, madam. Watch your footing. Okay. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm good with all that stuff right there. That was good. That was good, good, good. I think that was a headshot. I mean, it looks like I got her right in the eye. Maybe through the cheek. I want to I enjoy this shot. Um, yeah, through the cheek. Okay. That was a pretty decent shot, if I do say so myself. I guess at this point we can go ahead and turn in our quest. I mean, we don't need to keep running around doing this stuff. We will start running out of POIs before too long. I'd like to at least leave some of the tier two and threes to be done without, you know, re-looting them and all that. I don't know. No real rhyme or reason. Just would like them to still be kind of fresh instead of be like, eh, well, we just did this one two episodes ago, but you know, what the crap? Let's do it again. Yeah, that sort of thing. All right, back at Trader, whatever this guy is. Trader Bob? Is this a Trader Bob? This might be a Trader Bob. How you doing? We've still got a minute of uh, mashy bashy your face go smashy. So, try and get some use out of that. Trader Bob, I'm going into stealth mode. That does not mean I'm trying to rob you. We'll go ahead and take that pistol. I'm okay with that. Got some more tier two stuff. We could do one of those. Close the door. I didn't want that one. Uh, household Rancho 7. That sounds fine. I'm good with that. I just, I don't want to do farms right now. I'm kind of done with farms. Um, you're over here, aren't you? Ah, goodness. Wait a minute. Where are you? Oh, you're inside. How did you do that? You're a wizard, Harry. Wow, okay. You know, that reminds me. Lately, I've been watching some old school Night Court. There's a new Night Court show that's out now. And uh, watched the first couple episodes. Actually, it wasn't terrible. It was enjoyable. Mostly because of John Larroquette. But um, I've been watching the the OG show lately. Gone through, like, I don't know, the first eight episodes or something along those lines. Yeah, it's a good show. It holds up pretty well. I mean, it's still a product of its day with, uh, you know, some of the content. In terms of, you know... Things they say, things they do, etc., etc. Ah, you know what? No, that's fine. We'll keep it. But all that to say, I still enjoy that show. I used to watch it back in the day. I mean, I was pretty young, and I don't have—I don't know—I I didn't watch it religiously or anything. But you know, family stuff we'd kind of watch from time to time, and uh, it's a good show. Here, we need to eat some food, so let's go ahead and eat that bacon and eggs, and then. We gotta drop off most of this stuff. We'll take that one back because we don't want to lose our. Yeah, let's eat that guy too. And then I need to drink one of those. And I have no idea what we just put away. A bunch of things. Put away all those. 
and put that away. So let me just see. Yeah, that is our first proper firearm. No joke. That's pretty cool. Do we have any firearm mods that we can use? I don't see any other than a flashlight or a cripplum. So let's modify this guy because we can put... Um, maybe flashlights don't work that way in this version. I forget. It's been a while. I, I got used to those being a thing. I guess not. Well, that's still not bad. We could do that. This one, I was just going to go ahead and scrap. No real rhyme or reason. I just thought, yeah, you know, we can go ahead and collect some more parts. We might get to the point where we want to build, craft, whatever, some of these things. Let's go and get rid of that pipe pistol because that's just hot garbage. I don't even care about the pipe machine gun anymore or the pipe rifle for that matter. If we've got a pistol, I'm... I'm good enough with that. We don't need to have anything else. Keep the pipe shotgun just because. Um, it's the only shotgun we have. I mean, the rifle, I know that was the only rifle we had, but honestly, I don't care. I don't, I don't like the rifle that much to begin with. So let's take this stuff and we will uh, go somewhere else. To round out today's episode, we're just going to bash the crap out of some zombies because they're nearby. And I want the experience, but I also thought we could just go ahead and, you know, zap off a couple of rounds. Yes, we are near where we're going to be going. Look at that crap, dude. Oh, I broke the spell. I don't know what is going on. But it is just head explosion central right now. I guess uh, headshots in Romero mod are... Staggeringly effective is the only thing I can think of. I did not look at the XML to see what happens with headshots in Romero mod, but maybe there's a really, really high chance of dismemberment, decapitation, etc. That very well could be the case, and that would kind of fit in line with the idea of the mod, where if you're not getting head damage, you're really not getting much for damage. We'll leave it on that note with yet another bash of the head, and I'm going to go get me some chicken, I think. Catch you next one, Dylan. Thanks for watching. See you later.